Hey, this is Jill from Pies and Tails Reiki and Therapeutic Massage, and we just got done doing a meditation exercise together. And I drew the Reiki card for April, and I didn't want to drive it, draw it live because it would have involved me shifting around a lot and rustling leaves, and I didn't want to. Um... My duck friend is still there, my three duck friends. I don't know if you can see them. This camera is not as good as the one on the other side. So. What I drew for April, can you see it? It's called Conscious Choice. And of course I drew a long one and I don't have glasses and I'm in the shade, but hopefully all this natural light will work to my advantage. Okay, it says, anger is usually tied to responses in the past that are of little use to us as we grow personally and spiritually and is generally triggered when someone or something fails to meet our expectations, or sometimes, even more important, when we don't come up to our own expectations. However, although it may feel uncomfortable to realize it, anger is a conscious choice. And it's often just a habitual reaction, get that, a habitual reaction, to a given set of circumstances. So we can choose not to be angry just for today. And the beginning of the meditation exercise in the other video. What did I say? I had a rough week and I was going to be letting out anger and worry and resentment and even hate all back out into the universe as I exhaled. And wouldn't you know it, I randomly chose conscious choice. That anger is a conscious choice and it's a ha habit. So your lesson this week is to as much as you can, no one's perfect to make a conscious choice instead of a habitual reaction to certain things and don't get angry this time. If you can, just, it doesn't mean you have to be happy and joyous because some things are awful and they're not something to be happy or joyous about, but you can certainly take a neutral stance. It doesn't make you a bad person to take a neutral stance. It's better for your health and your spirit Sometimes we just have to sit back and take a neutral course and recharge. All right, and that actually helps us send more love. Have a fantastic month of April. So we're all gonna work on our anger this month. And I'm gonna give you back to the pond. See my little duck friends are still there, still trying to meditate. Oops, sorry, don't want you to be that close. <laughs> All right, have a blessed month and a blessed day, and a blessed week and a blessed year.